I've said back again now. <laughs> Hi baby girls and baby boys. <laughs> Hi the Luskies. This is a baby girl Chidelo. Where can Chidelo? Should the start? Oh, nearly where came I? Why you know me? What will happen this afternoon? I'm always hyper. I bet they come like that. <laughs> if this is a better of seeing me, thank you so much. And if you're a returning subscriber, <clears throat> you know the vibes already. So in this video, I'm talking about Ghana slangs and like intonations or words that they pronounce that are still in my mouth do you get like even after i've left that place for a, like it's up to six years now but, but i still talk like, for i still talk like that and a lot of people always think that this girl she's a gadia but no i mean an evil girl all the person nigerian babe <laughs> if you want to see that come washing the first what i will say it is getting massa like massa 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 if you even watch my videos like if you if you are really like observant when you're watching my videos you know that i'm always saying massa ah but guy is passing if you watch my video if you follow my my, my videos very well you will know that as i'm talking in one some of my videos i'm always saying things like i'm always saying massa 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 like what if I say that's it? A lot of people always think, ah, in this country, this girl, are you a guy I'm like, no, I'm not a guy there. It's just that something is, I don't agree to leave my mouth. <laughs> you can take Mohammed to the mouth. What's that thing? You can take Mohammed to the mouth. You can take Mohammed away from the mouth. I can't remember. You know that? You can take, oh yeah, you can take a horse to get drink water. We cannot force a horse to drink water. It's, I mean, that's how they say that thing. Shasha, that is it. I've left the country ever since. But this massa, it is not going away from me. <laughs> another slag again that sorry, another word that has stuck with me ever since I left Ghana is pronunciation of bot. B U T. In Nigeria we say bot, but then Ghana Ghanaians they say bat. So if I'm talking about I'm, I'm always saying bat, 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 bat. And I think that's the reason why a lot of people think that I am Ghanaian, even though that I am not one. Because of the way I talk, so I'm always saying bats, 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 instead of saying bots. Do you understand? So, maybe girl has tried. Maybe girl has tried. Like, I, if I want to talk like a full Nigerian, like speak like a Nigerian in terms of the way we pronounce stuff, I have to be conscious of myself. Like, okay, I'm about to pronounce this thing now. I have to pronounce it in, pronounce it in a Nigerian way. But if I'm just talking off, of, off from my mind, like just speaking English, communicating with people the probability of me using bats instead of bots is so high <laughs> so anyways the next slag that i always say it has all of my mouth is cra ah, you cra what is wrong with you uh -uh. what is wrong with you cra <laughs> I always say that it all the time. Even my videos, you know, I'm always saying it. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think cry is like when you are trying to like buttress something, like to show the is it, like the severity of the thing. I don't know. I don't know. I think that's what it is. Or I think cry means like why now? Look, that Nigerians would say why now? Like the way with the now, like n not n o w n a u. I think so, but I'm not sure. Yes, yeah. another um, Ghana slang that is still in my mouth is Papa. <laughs> this one, this one, like, I think I say that every day. Uh uh, I, I, like, and I, I always say that when I'm trying to, like, you know, really emphasize on something like, where Jimmy Papa, like, he ate that very well. Can I say something like, uh, don't let enter my head that is insult. Where Jimmy Papa. Uh, like all those things like I can't, I can't give an example now but when, when I'm talking like you know that thing that when you're talking everything just flows effortlessly yeah so papa is one of that thing that is still in my mouth it's not going away another word that I always use from Ghana is aden hmm. you know what aden is aden is why so sometimes like and I, I realized that I use I I normally use aden like when I'm getting frustrated or like somebody's annoying me. Do you get? You know, be like ah uh ah -uh, no aden. Why did you do this thing now? Why like aden now? Uh ah. -uh. It's not funny. No, it's not funny. I, I beg. It's not funny. 
And that's when I used to use that at the another word that I that is still in my mouth, or rather, this one is this one is an intonation, or the way I pronounce my words is walk, like W O R K. In Nigeria here, we say walk, but I know Ghanaians they say work. I am working. So I'm always saying maybe someone will call me as I'm working, like I'm cutting. I'm like I'm working. How far? I'm working. I'm working. I'm working. I'm always saying that instead of me to say I'm working. Just that. <laughs> so another intonation that is playing my mouth like this one is still there it's not going anywhere is let me say like if, if i want to say anything that has i o n in it in nigeria here we say shon 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 but then in Ghana we say they say shin so i want to say something like communication instead of saying communication like nigerians i will, I will say Communication, education, intonation, shen, 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 and it comes right to suffer. Hey, even for love, for the teacher. So that's what I always say. So whenever, whenever I'm talking, like I am communicating or conversing with somebody in English, and I don't know. You know that thing that when you leave your country to go and um, study, so and for a long time, you are not more used to like speaking the your sorry because i know your country your native black dialect cannot really speak it so your only way or your only form of communication is english yeah so now i'm back to nigeria and as i'm conversing with people i always tend to converse with them in english instead of using my language or speak broken so when i'm talking to people like i'm conversating with them and then i'm using shun sorry shun like communication and pronunciation instead of saying pronunciation they'll not be like ah are you a Ghanaian or something? Especially if they don't know me, like they don't know my name or something. They don't ask me, are you a Ghanaian? I'm like, no. Once they ask me that question, I realize that, oh, I've probably pronounced something as a Ghanaian as I'm talking plenty here. <laughs> and I'll be like, no, I'm not a Ghanaian. I'm a Nigerian. I'm Igbo. 100% Igbo. 247. 365 days. But, you know, I can't, if we, I've said that again now. <laughs> Myself, what is already my mouth is my mouth. I cannot even keep myself. Do you get so that is another one. <laughs> another Ghana word that is like in my mouth all the time now is my bread. You know, like when I'm tired, I'll be like, Ah, my bread, I'm tired. Like, my bread, my bread. I'm always saying that one. And then most of the times, when I say that to people, don't understand what I'm saying. I'm like, Ah, it's true. I'm not in Ghana. This one don't understand what I'm saying. And I'll be like, Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm tired. And this usually happens like when I'm talking to like my friend, like someone that's my friend. It's not like someone that is like, it's not like an official kind of conversation. Like in an informal setting. Do you understand? For, and I'll be like, My bread, I'm tired, I'm tired, I'm tired. Yeah, I'll see, I'll see, I'll see. I cannot keep myself. The thing is already there, the thing is already there. So, another word that this one I'm always using, but then I feel like this one is popular. Even Ghana, Nigerians that have not been, been to Ghana, they also use it is Shali. Shali, how far? Shali, so. Shali, what's in the song? Shali, I they go your in there. I'm mean, in there, like I'm they come your place or something. I don't even know. <laughs> Shall I I go the babe in there? I they go there. <laughs> well, I think I, I I'm going to make a video speaking like I'm going to make a video using broken English to talk from beginning to the end. But not gonna like broken English because I, mean, I cannot speak that word. Gonna na Nigerian pigeon English. But it will make sense. It will make mad sense. Comment down below if you want to see me make a video from beginning to end speaking purely nigerian pidgin english i know most of my audience are Ghanaians, but then you know if you want to see something like that let me know what else if you're enjoying this video guys if you're enjoying this video i like my vibe i love what i'm about please subscribe to my channel give this video a thumbs up and then leave a comment down below just tell me if you don't have anything to say just tell me baby girl i love you or i like you just tell me in the comment section i like you i love you <laughs> Don't want to be like, what is wrong with this girl? Okay, sure. You guys already know that naturally I am hyper. Naturally, so that's how I am to force everyone. See you guys in my next one.